Hello, this is Jane Talbot. I am squeezed for time for today's adventure and fancy a little break from romantic fiction. So I thought I would try something different today. I'm just walking up the street close to my house and I'm taking with me this. It's a little book to help you to identify trees. So I thought using information from this book, looking at the leaves alone, whether I would be able to identify three trees that I have been up until this point not been able to recognise before. So here Okay, we go. here's the first one. This has lobed leaves and it has this characteristic white flower. Can you see that? Oops, maybe I'm too close. And if we look at the bark, the bark is brown and flaking. These flowers, which are characteristic, they're supposed to appear in late May, so that would be about right. So let me show you a leaf closer up if I can. I think that's all. So awful. right now, I think I am standing underneath a larch tree. So larches have these, I'm going to hold it up to see if you can see it, fine needles. They have the beginnings of tiny, tiny, you probably can't see them. Maybe hold this one up. Cones on them. If we have a look at the bark, the bark's really interesting. Here, if we have a look at the bark, it should be grey or brown, breaking into long fissures. So yep, yeah, I think that is So this a is the final one, and I think this is a common lime. So it's got these very large, round leaves. And if you look, the twigs, the branches, are supposed to be bare, so they're not prickly in any way at all. Try and have a look at the bark. I'm supposed to be looking for long ridges and cracks. Long ridges, there's some cracks with sprouting bosses. Yep, I think that is a lime tree.